I am speaking to the one and only... Will Reed. And Will, what do you do? Uh, I'm a software engineer for Pivotal Labs. What the hell is Pivotal Labs? So Pivotal Labs is a consulting, software consulting uh, agency, and we do a lot of web development, iOS development, and Android development. And uh, why would I want to work for Pivotal Labs? Why wouldn't you want to work for Pivotal Labs? Uh, the reason I like working for Pivotal Labs is that it's, it's a team environment, right? We do pair programming all the time. We write tests before, uh, before we write code. And so it's a very kind of sustainable culture, right? Where I know that when I hit deploy, things are going to go out well because I've got confidence around the code that I just wrote. I know that my skills are going to continue to increase because I'm sitting next to someone who's maybe got database talent, and he's sharing that with me when we're tackling database problems. I've got skills around HTML and CSS, and he's learning those from me. So the floor continues to raise up at, at the organization. So actually, that's a really good point. So you've got uh, essentially a, a very vibrant learning experience because of the way that you've set up your development platform through the pair programming. I mean, would you say that's your favorite part about your job? Oh yeah, I love teaching. Um, if I wasn't writing software, I'd probably be in a school somewhere. But you're kind of getting the best of both worlds here, yes? You bet, I get the pay and all the glory. <laughs> so okay, so what, what are you looking for in terms of talent? I mean, you told me the specifics in terms of, well, or, or you said what your company is, so I'm assuming you're looking for all that development talent, yes? You bet, that's right. And in addition to that, we're, we're not, our shop is maybe language specific. We do a lot of Rails development. But I came from a .NET background. We've got guys with Java and C++ that they all learned it by being next to us. And really what we're looking for is people that learn by doing, right? So it's the pairing that really teaches the specifics of the language that we're in today. So let me ask you, if you had a situation where you needed to hire a certain talent with a certain language, would you bring them on even if they didn't have skill in that specific language, but had skills in other languages? And have you done that in the past? Absolutely, all the time. Um, so again, we're looking for for the kind of developer who's who's kind of nimble and not not fighting the holy war about whatever's better. It's really the tool that that fits the job is the kind of people that that fit in well at Pivotal Labs. So we're always um, looking for sort of more the ap empathetic developer who can sit next to somebody and talk and engage and and be friendly and and learn through that process as well. All right, so I want to work at Pivotal Labs. How do I get your attention and how do I make it through what I'm guessing is a grueling hiring process or, excuse me, a grueling sort of uh, interview process? It's not actually that grueling. So what you want to start off doing is just heading to pivotallabs.com slash jobs to figure out where we are and what, what kind of openings we've got that might fit your need. But then the interview process is very low stress um, from the sense that it's not, it's not quizzes, it's not... Um, tell me about the intricacies of how such and such a data structure is implemented. We have you sit down and pair with us. You're going to peel off a story on our one of our clients' backlogs. You're going to start tackling it and talking about it with the, the interviewee sitting next to you. And we're going to look to see, you know, can you, can you verbalize what it is that you're thinking? You may not know the syntax, but you can at least tell us, like, I think it should be structured this way, and it has some feeling like this. Or, what about this problem where maybe they didn't supply the correct ID? And so through that conversation and through the day, we're gonna, we're gonna basically get a good feel for whether or not you can absorb some knowledge and contribute back. Excellent, hey, thank you so much for your time. Thank you.